living in Zurich and commuting a lot, for me, it's very important to be really on time and organized. So I take normally the train at eight o'clock in the morning. So I'm exactly at the same time in the lab. So I started as a physical chemist. And I still remember when I started in my PhD in a biology lab, I think the turning moment was the first time I saw a cell under the microscope. I think that was the moment I realized that really seeing is believing and I had these cells under the microscope. And so I think that was the first moment. The other very big, I think, important moment is when I started here at the FMI. I started my lab. Um, with very challenging and ambitious ideas and uh, without a lot of preliminary data on the work I wanted to do. In the lab we work on how individual cells can create multicellular systems. So these are in a way tissues that are built in vitro, so we create mini in organs. This is our lychee microscope where we can image organoid from individual cells to fully form organoid up to two or three weeks. What we can do is a sheet of light here in this 3D printed chamber and this sheet of light is able to illuminate the sample very mildly and this is really allow us to grow organoid in their environment for weeks. In the lab we are trying to understand how these cells coordinate the, their behavior to create higher order structures and these patterns, multicellular systems, such as an intestinal organoid. Yeah. So this is an automated microscope where we can image thousands and ten thousand, hundred thousand of organoids per round. Receiving this prize is something that really gives me uh, like a very big honor and I'm very happy about it. On the other side, I think it's an incredible recognition for, for the lab and for the lab member. My advice for young scientists would be to really find their uh, genuine self and to try to find what authentically is important for them and not be afraid on then following those desires and ambitions. My best way to balance my personal life and my two children that are very uh, like core part of my life is to do a lot of outdoors. So I go hiking a lot or skiing in, in winter, climbing, horseback riding. That really helps me to, to free my mind. I always leave the house in order to be in time with a Vespa, like an Italian Vespa, so I can go very fast from the train station back home and uh, not lose too much time.